Crazy story, long story short. The two of us got to talk to each other in Palm Springs a number of years ago okay. when you had won the tournament and I was working for the Tour Network and we were both a little giddy about the whole thing. Sure, sure. DJ Trahan, welcome back to Harbortown and Hilton Head. How are you? I'm great, thank you very much. Talk about, uh, it's been a crazy journey the last few years, uh, but you're back in, you're in the tournament, you got a chance to do something special. Well, sure. I mean, I've got an opportunity to play this week, which is tremendous. I, you know, I, I got hurt probably six or seven years ago, mm -hmm. and um, my game suffered tremendously, mentally, physically, all the way around. I was in a bad place, and um, you know, fortunately for me, I've kind of dug deep. I've, I'm, I'm grinding. I'm doing some good things, and, and my game's starting to show some signs of life again. And I'm excited about that. I'm not too old to uh, keep going at this. 38's not young, but yeah. it's not old either. So um, you're just hitting your prime. Come I'm, on. I hope so. I mean, it seems like your prime. You need to be 22 these days to play against <laughs> these kids. But you know, it's uh, I'm enjoying it, man, and it's nice to be playing some good golf again. And so I'm obviously looking forward to this week very much. Talk about what this year has been like you've been playing in some events uh, particularly web web events no no i haven't no. played any web events this year just pga tour events okay. um i'm playing well though i've had a couple top 10s another couple top 20s so i'm, I'm my consistency's kind of coming and uh you know like i said i'm just really optimistic and i'm keeping my head up high and i'm just trying to grind away at it you know i'm really starting to enjoy the process again does anybody know this course any better than you do? That's I, the good news. Huh? I mean, I grew up here, but, uh, <laughs> you know, Harbor Town's pretty straightforward. I don't think you need to know too many tricks of the trade here. It demands good ball striking and, you know, obviously with tight fairways and small greens. So there's no real rocket science to figure in this golf course out. Typically, the guys that are striking it well are going to be the guys that are in contention on Sunday. So hopefully I can bring my A game tee to green and then hold a few putts, and that usually gets it done around here. There you go. Last question. Now, I know you live in Charleston now, but, boy, some special memories of being back down here, aren't there? Oh, sure. I grew up here, you know. You know, Hilton Head is, uh, you know, it's another it's another version of home for me. I don't come back here very often because uh, there's no need to other than to play the tournament. But, uh, you know, it's it still feels like home and it's uh, it's always a, a great feeling to come back here. Good luck to you this week. It'll be a lot of fun to see you be in the hunt on Sunday. I appreciate that. Thank you. Look at that smile. <laughs> He's got to get to work. Uh, we'll talk more about the tournament as things continue right here on our special edition of WHHI at the RBC Heritage.